Okay, here's part two of On Your Own. Let's see how you did. On number 15, it says the low temperatures on three days are shown to the right. That's right here. What are the opposites of the three temperatures? So the opposite of two, negative two is two. The opposite of four is negative four. And the opposite of negative seven is seven. Now we have to graph them. So the opposite of two is two. So we have, we have two and we have negative two. Then we have negative four and positive four. Then we have seven and, pos and negative seven. So graph the temperatures and their opposites on the number line. And look at that, we did that. Next is 16, explain how to use a number line to find the opposites of the integers that are four units away from negative six. So I'm gonna change to text to make it a little bit easier for myself. So we can count, count four, away from negative six. And when I do that in both directions, as it didn't tell us which directions to go, then find the numbers that are the same distance from zero as the two numbers, but on opposite side of zero. That was a little complicated there, but they didn't tell us the exact number, so it said four units away from negative six, so we count four for it and four after it, and then we figure out on the opposite side of zero, what the opposite is. Number 17, atoms are made of tiny particles called protons, neutrons, and electrons. Po protons and neutrons are in the center of the atom, making up the nucleus. The electrical charges on the proton and electron are exactly the same size, but opposite. If a proton has a positive charge of one, what is the charge of the corresponding Electrons. So we're asking ourselves, so what is the opposite? And so that was a lot of work just to get the answer for that. So we're looking at what is the, what is the opposite of one? That is negative one. Okay, 18, 19, 20 probably should be, be your quickest on here because it says write the opposite of the integer. Opposite of negative six is positive six. The opposite of negative two is positive two. The opposite of 17 is negative 17. And we're gonna wrap this one up with graph the integers on a number line. So we have two, sorry, negative two. I'm gonna zoom this in a little bit so we can see it just a tad bit better. There we go. So we have negative one, negative two. So our dot goes right here on negative two. We have four, so one, two, three, four. We have negative five, so negative one, negative two, negative three, negative four, negative five. And we have 10 all the way over here. And that's it with On Your Own. Your next step is going to be your homework step.